Hello there. Welcome to this video on how to access ebooks from the EBSCOhost database. I'm going to walk you through the simple steps to discover and enjoy a world of knowledge right from the comfort of your own device. First, open your preferred web browser and navigate to the UJ Library website. You can find it at www.uj.ac.za/library. When on the library webpage, click on the database A to Z. Use the provided menu to filter the database according to the letter E. Then click on the submit button. You get a listing of all the ebook databases starting with the letter E. Click on EBSCOhost ebook collection. Next, you need to authenticate yourself using the UJ credentials. Ensure that you choose the right university category such as student or staff. You are now on the basic search mode of the EBSCOhost platform. Please note that you can go to the advanced search mode for a search that is more focused. However, the basic search mode will still allow you to access a full range of ebooks. If you prefer, you can browse the available categories or subject fields to discover the relevant titles. The books listed under highlights are recommendations that you might also find interesting. You can start your ebook search by entering relevant keywords or book title in the search bar. Click on search. You have found some results. Explore the search results and use the filters on the left to refine your search. You can filter by publication date, subject and more to find the perfect ebook for your needs. Note that there are a number of results for each search. The titles of the ebooks are written in blue followed by abstracts detailing the contents underneath. For chapter downloads, click on the PDF icon or the provided table of contents link. Click on a specified chapter of your choice. Your specific chapter is displayed in the main pane. Then click on the download icon. Note that in some instances there are limitations to the number of pages that can be provided. In this example, there are no limitations. You can specify the number of pages that can be provided in your PDF by clicking on the radio buttons. To finalize the download, please click on the download PDF button. Your PDF is downloaded in your downloads area. Access it from there. The option for a full download allows you to borrow the book and use it offline. There are different options for a full download. In some instances, you can download the entire book, allowing you to access it offline. Once downloaded, the book will be stored on your device and you can find it in your downloads area for continued access. In other cases, there are stricter measures in how offline use is offered. In those cases, there will be a specific number of days within which you can use the book. In this case, you can borrow the book for one week. For this kind of download, you need to have a software called Adobe Digital Editions installed on your device. This is a free software program for reading and managing ebooks. If you do not have this software installed, please click on the Adobe Digital Editions link in blue. Follow the prompts to download the software. Please note that in some instances, you might be prompted to authorize your computer. Once that is done, click in the I have Adobe Digital Editions checkbox, then click on full download. You will get a notification that you have borrowed the ebook for a specified number of days. Go to your downloads area to access the book using the Adobe Digital Editions software. Your book opens on the Adobe Digital Editions platform. Use the table of contents to navigate the book. Alternatively, you can use the scroll bar to page through the book. Right click on any part of the text to highlight, add a note or bookmark a text. Your bookmarks will be saved in the bookmarks area. And that's it. You've learned how to access ebooks from the EBSCOhost database via the UJ library. It's a fantastic resource that can enrich your academic journey. Please reach out to your faculty librarian should you require further assistance. The University of Johannesburg, the future reimagined.